One of the standard commands on a Linux system is the PWD command, the print working directory command. Now this command is rather simple. All it does is it prints the current working directory, the directory that you're currently in. Now PWD doesn't really have a whole lot of flags and options to it. What I've shown you here is the standard usage of PWD, like 99.9% .9 of the time. You're just gonna type PWD and get the directory that you're currently working in. But there is one somewhat useful flag in certain situations. If you're in a directory that involves symlinks, you can give PWD the dash capital P flag for physical path rather than the logical path. So it's going to resolve all the sim links and give you the true path, the physical path. And let me show you this in action. So let me CD into a directory I know has um, some sim links in it. So I CD'd into the snap directory. I have two snap packages installed on the system. Let me CD into the trading view directory and do an LS. And one of the directories in here is current. And you can see it is a sim link. It is actually sim linked to 64. So if I CD into current and run PWD, I get the working directory as slash home slash dt slash snap slash trading view slash current. But if I want the physical path, I would do pwd dash capital P for physical. And now I get the actual physical path. And you can see that slash home slash dt slash snap slash trading view slash 64. So it resolved the sim link. Now there is one other flag, the dash capital L for the logical path. And that would print your standard output here of slash home slash dt slash snap slash trading view slash current. That is essentially the default behavior of PWD without any flags. So you're probably never really going to use dash capital L. So really PWD dash capital P is the only flag with PWD. If you want to learn more about PWD, type man PWD to read the man page.